Hey guys, what's up? Today we're going to take a look at the Juden Sentai Kyoryuger, but this time we have a repaint version of this one right here. Now, unfortunately, this is going to be the only video that, you guys, that I'm going to show you guys. So I actually do apologize for that, but don't worry, I'll have other random videos, you know, that I'll probably put in. So yeah. Uh, anyways, today I'm going to take a look at the Deluxe Kyoryuchin Dark Full action version. Now, if you guys remember, Bandai Japan releasing the the original Kyoryujin, but in a full articulation version. So this was just a, you know, a straight repaint. And if you guys don't remember, back in the day, 10 years ago, Bandai Japan did release a dark Kyoryujin, which is just a straight repaint of Gabutera, Toriken, and, not Toriken, Stekochi, and Torikera. So yeah. So anyways, here's what the puzzle is actually going to look like right here. Looks pretty amazing. Of course, you can see Deluxe Kyorijin Dark Full Action version right here. And right off the bat, the painted scope of the detail of this mecha right there looks pretty cool. And of course, anyone's going to ask what the American name of, her, name of this one. The Dino Charge Mega, Megazord, so yeah. Um, the only differences between that one and the, and the original one is, of course, the color differences, so yeah. To be honest with you, the black and gold with the hints of gray on it looks actually pretty cool, to be honest with you. It's like an evil version of Kyoryujin, and I actually do like it a lot. Now, Gabotera will have some awesome articulation. The, the head and the neck will move side to side, of course, up and down. They will have some ball joints on the legs, on the feet right there, looks pretty nice. Articulation knees, elbows, and everything right there. And it has like some little bit of butterfly joints, which is actually pretty nice to it right there. And of course, the Stiko sword right there, by the way, is like that, so yeah. And even though you can actually combine with the Deluxe King Ultra, you can actually do the same thing with the Deluxe King Ultra Zero. So here we have, you know, the got Praying Mantis, Was, uh, Populon right there in the Dragonfly. This is from the King Ultra Zero set right there. So you could do King Kyoryujin Zero? I think that's how you call it. So yeah. Gobble Terror looks good. The only problem is, is the Visible Head Syndrome right there. It sucks. So yeah. Stegoch looks okay, but unfortunately he's just a brick. So that's not much. Same thing with Torikera. Not too much either. So yeah. This will be this will be cost about $180. And that we'll be releasing next year of March. So yeah. Anyways, I actually do recommend that to have this in your collection if you guys want to get it. Or if not, it's your choice. So yes. Anyways, you guys, I'm gonna end this right here. So have fun, stay safe, and always I'm out.